Hi everyone, I'm going to show you how to fill in your information for part two of the animal classification project. I'm giving you the directions one day at a time so that way by Friday you will have one complete project and assignment to turn in for me that's all on the same organism. So you can see that again I'm asking you to restate the name of the organism that you already chose. It cannot be lake trout because that's the example that I've been giving. You're going to type in the predators of your organism, the prey of your organism, and if your organism is a producer or a consumer. So you can see my work that I already did for the lake trout is here. All I'm going to do is go to part two and type in lake trout. Again, this is just my example. And the other thing that I'm going to pull up is Lake Michigan Food Web. So this is available for you. If it is difficult for you to flip back and forth between Google Docs, then I would recommend taking a picture of this food web and that way you can just have it saved to your phone and it's easier for you to access. <clears throat> now, if I'm looking for the predators of the lake trout, that means that I'm looking for the organisms that eat the lake trout. So I can see the organisms that eat the lake trout are the walleye and the great blue heron. These arrows are showing me that the lake trout is giving its energy to the walleye and to the great blue heron. So I'm just going to type in walleye, great blue heron. Okay. Next, I'm asking for the prey of your specific organism. This means that the, organis the organisms that your animal eats. So I know the organisms that my animal eats because they are all pointing to the lake trout. So that would be chub, lake whitefish, and these lines can get very confusing, so I would recommend going slow. Next, I'm going to follow this line back. I see lake herring, yellow perch, and turtles. Last, I'm typing in, is my lake trout a producer or a consumer? Since it is not a plant, that means it's a consumer. All producers are plants and all plants are producers. So if you did not choose a plant, then that means it's automatically a consumer. Once you've typed in all this information, just press uh, turn in, and then I will upload the directions for the last part tomorrow. Thanks, guys. Let me know if you have questions. Bye.